This is a Chucky Beat production. production. In this video, I'm about to show y'all boys how to make the best ISO build on NBA 2K22. I'm talking about strictly ISO, no defense, just ISO alone. Alone. This is the most overpowered offensive build on NBA 2K22, in my opinion. Make sure y'all boys drop a like, drop a sub, turn on notifications, man, and let's get right into the video so for for the position we want to go with shooting guard because this is going to allow us to get more badges i go lefty because i'm lefty rl and then you can choose whatever jersey number that you would like for the pot chart we're going to go mostly blue with some green for the physical profile you always want to go with speed and this is how you want to set up your attributes so if you set up your attributes like this and go with the shooting guard position your badge spread out is 16 16 16 and 6 which is super op if you guys know me you know that i have the catfish two-way session playmaking version of this build that version of the build is focused more on defense but as far as offense and iso goes this is the best iso badge spread that you can possibly have this pie chart gets Hall of Fame finishing and everything else gold. As far as a body shape goes, you can go with whatever you want. Most of the time, I go with compact for the height. Since we're going for ISO and offense on this build, you want to go six foot three. You can go six foot two if you'd like to get more speed, but I like to be at least six three minimum. So that's what we're going to go with. For the weight, you want to put the weight all the way down and then you want to up it just a little bit to where you get some strength but you don't lose any speed or acceleration. So as far as the wingspan go, if we're talking about a strictly ISO, I'll put your wingspan at 81.3. The reason for this, so check this out. Once you get this built to 99 overall, you're going to have an 85 driving dunk from the plus 4 for hitting 99 overall. So you're going to have contact dunks at 99 overall. For your three ball you're gonna be able to spark that hoe up you're gonna have an 83 ball which is more than enough but once you get to that 83 ball threshold you're gonna be able to shoot way more consistent for the ball handle this is the most important part whenever we're talking about iso most people don't realize this but you want to have that 85 ball control at 99 overall whenever you get an 85 ball control that unlocks a few different moves you get the cheesy between the legs film 
and you also get the nutmeg you get the fast spin back and you also get the fast momentum and you just dribble faster in general it's super important to have an 85 ball control on your iso builds because that locks every single glitchy dribble move your defense is still kind of solid um you get five defensive badges on this build the reason why i did not make this version of the build is i like to have better defense on my build so on my catfish 2a slash and playmaker we have max wingspan with more defensive badges and attributes but as far as iso goes in my opinion this is the best iso build at 99 overall super op this is like the bpb the b he build from nba 2k20 and then for your takeover you can choose whatever you want on this build on my version of the build i want to play making because that's the most fun to me but playmaking takeover is kind of doo-doo i would either go with slashing or shooting whichever one you want to do on this build i'd probably go with shooting because finishing is already super op on this game as is and then you guys can see that it comes out as a slashing playmaker and now i'm going to show you guys all the badges that you should equip on this build so for your finishing i would probably do something like this 16 finishing badges on hall of fame is so op especially on this game where the paint defense is not very good and once you unlock the contact dunks on this build you're going to be able to get even better animations around the rim so for your shooting once you get this build maxed out at 99 overall you're going to have an 80 plus three ball and these are going to be the badges that you need 16 shooting badges is more than enough with that 83 ball rating plus this badge shooting loadout you're going to be shooting extremely consistent especially on the iso so for your playmaking we get gold playmaking badges on this build which is again more than enough to go crazy on the iso especially if you dribble like i do but you get everything that you need to dribble and go crazy quick first step quick chain and hit us for days all on gold unpluckable on silver bullet passer on silver to dot the corners bail out ankle breaker and tight handles on bronze just to get some stumble animations but you can literally mix it up however you would like for your defense we still get six defensive badges and you can really adjust this however you would like depending on who you're going up against but this would probably be my primary defensive badge loadout so yeah man make this build if you want to go absolutely crazy on the iso like i said this is the best offensive build on nba 2k22 in my opinion make sure boys drop a like drop a sub turn on notifications man we out peace